Hi there and uh, welcome back to the Floss Marketing School. In this video, I'm going to just make a short introduction to augmented uh, reality. And for this, I'm going to use um, uh, a mobile app, which I found on the Play Store, which is the one of um, IKEA, so it's named IKEA Space. And the huge advantage of this app is that you can uh, easily uh, see what uh, your furniture is bought at IKEA looks like so um, in fact you just need to scan your room and then you just need to add the furniture that you want so for example here this given furniture and then I need to say okay I want to try it and as you can see then I'm getting the uh, the furniture that I want and then I can I can put it here within my room and then I can see around how it looks like and, and so on and so forth so this is a um, uh, augmented reality so that's uh, the possibility for you uh, to see to, to put actually uh, something visual thanks to a device or here in my case it was a mobile phone on, uh, on a real world environment and see how it looks like um, what I'm going to show you today is um, is a technology uh, that I uh, find out on by making some search on the internet, which is AR.js, and it's great because it's an open source uh, project, so you can uh, easily access to it on uh, GitHub. I put the link uh, over here. Yep. And uh, what is great with this technology is that it doesn't uh, require you to create an app or anything like this. Everything is based on on, uh, on JavaScript uh, line of code. So when you land on this project on GitHub, the only thing that you need to copy and paste are those lines. So you can easily copy and paste it and integrate it to any uh, web page that, uh, that you have. And then you can already start uh, to play with it. Uh, so that's uh, what we're going to do today. Um, and actually, there are great tutorials on this given page. Uh, for example, I found out, was it this one? Um, well, they put all their content information on um, on Medium, and uh, it's really great tutorial. Actually, I just followed this one, and just by following this one, I already started to uh, take out the most of AR.js. So, um, so it just works with a tiny line of code, and what I'm going to do is that I'm going to use directly the shortcut that they provide you, uh, which is hosted on CodePen, and uh, here it is. So. Uh, here what it does is that actually it's directly executing those given 10 lines of code directly within uh, your browser. So in my case, I'm going to use I'm gonna use my webcam, which is this one. Okay, is it the one? Yes, that's that's the one that I wanted to, to show. That's the right uh, webcam. And, um, and yeah, I'm going to show you what those 10 lines of code are doing. In fact, those 10 lines of code are looking for um, a card which is um, this the given tag, okay? So it's looking for um, a card which is named uh, hero. And then if you can find this given hero physical card on this given space that you can see over here, what it's gonna do is that it's gonna show out a box uh, which has a position of 0, 0 0.5. Uh, zero something which will be a color yellow. So now what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take one of those uh, what they call hero card. So uh, you can get the hero card directly on the on the website of um, on the GitHub project website, or you can even create your own thanks to uh, services such as this one, which is actually the same as the one who created the project. Um, so let me go back on yep over here. So I get my hero card. I can show you like this uh, quickly, and now I can I can pause it, and if I was it like uh, like this? Oops. Okay. As you can see, I get in augmented reality the given uh, the given cube. So um, of course here it doesn't uh, make much sense. It's just a cube, but you can imagine that you can create your own object. You can go to your customer, and you can directly uh, show them the different products that your company is uh, is building. And you can, in fact, see those uh, products in, in real life environment, what it looks like for real. So that's why that's great. Uh, it's great. And um, 
And what you can do as well is uh, if you would like to start to play with this given um, project, which is AR.js, uh, you can go on this uh, given documentation where you get different uh, examples of a tag that you can uh, just pick up. Uh, so for example, you can take a uh, cylinder with work, I don't know. Um, so a cylinder, crimson radius, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's take, uh, we're gonna try, we can take this one. I'm um, gonna go over here and just gonna change this, uh, this given, this given line. Oops, oops, get this one in plus, okay, great. Um, so I'm gonna just say a no, a no, just this one. Okay, can I? Oh, ooh. okay. So here, okay, we can see it, but what is happening is actually the uh, dimension that I gave within this cylinder a bit too big. So that's the reason why you cannot. Yes, you cannot. Um, you cannot see it. So probably if I just put the eight of, I don't know. Um, just say zero. 0.3 and radius 0.5 oops um, like this this and this will probably get better okay you see so that's it um, that's everything that I wanted to show you a great technology which is open source which does not require you to create um, an app directly either in Xcode or either in Android Studio you can you can have fun with it uh, straight away uh, as far as you have a webcam you can use it as well on mobile actually they provide you all the information in order to to do it and you can play with many other features such as uh, geolocation such as interaction with the sync with the object as well it's very very powerful you just need to spend a bit of time uh, experiencing it Hope you enjoy um, this um, this small tutorial introduction to AR and um, and thanks for watching.